Yeah, well, for a start-up team, they've been sensational. So, you know, they're not sitting on the bottom of the ladder and, you know, certainly we can't afford to be taking our foot off the accelerator and, and taking them lightly. So, you know, I've been very, very impressive and for a, uh, a start-up club wanting to set up a culture, you know, they've done a fantastic job. It's they nice. are, yeah. They've still got a good quality of, you know, experienced players in there and obviously Gary Ablett's having a terrific year and Jared Brennan's helping out. But certainly their uh, they're young players would be, you know, in, in any team in the AFL. So uh, we certainly have to do our homework and thankfully we have had a few games that we can, uh, you know, get some uh, background on them. No, Nick was very disappointed. Yeah, he probably uh, had a few tickets lined up, I'd say, for uh, family and friends. But uh, you know, and he's just managed to get his form, you know, back on track as well. So he didn't want to uh, have any glitches in, you know, and stopping that continuity. So uh, it's disappointing for him, but give someone a, a fresh chance or otherwise another forward to spend some more time on the field. Uh, Tom Walsh, well, he played a couple of weeks ago as a forward and played well. But we can also restructure it with, you know, there's some experience in our VFL team with Jason Blake and, and Stephen Baker as well as um, Tom Walsh, Tom Simpkins. So, you know, it just depends on the mix and, and what happens at training tonight. Now, there were some good signs from, you know, pretty well a full game um, last week against Port Melbourne. So, uh, but he's missed a lot of footy and, and certainly had an interrupted pre-season. So we'd love to have him back ASAP, but certainly won't be reckless about it. But uh, hopefully the sooner the better for our team. Yeah, Stephen King's done a terrific job with you know his improvement. He's only 22, so you know usually they say those tall tall fellas take a take a little bit of extra time. But you know his contested marking around the place has been uh, you know huge for us. And certainly if um, Michael Gardner can get back, then he can spend some more time forward, which would be another uh, another asset for us. Definitely. You know, no one uh, no one wants to lose to a first you know a first year team, and uh, you know we're certainly not taking them lightly. I've seen them kick some very easy and quick goals, and even last week against Collingwood and match them in the second half. So regardless of what uh, you know what tactics Colin would changed or, or maybe moved to you know to be equal with them in a half a footies you know a terrific effort